Hi, today I'm going to show you how to make some floating chalk prints. We're going to use some objects you can hopefully find at home or they're not too hard to get. Um, here I have a container with about an inch full of water. You don't need too much water. You could even do a smaller container if you want. I have some chalk that I got from, oh my goodness, I have some chalk that I got from Walgreens for about 99 cents for a big old box. Uh, it's a little bit better, actually a lot of bit better to use actual art chalk pastels because the colors will be much brighter, but this will work because that's what I have. Um, you'll need some paper. Thicker paper is better. Really thin paper might not work as well and lined paper probably won't work. And you'll need a plastic card. I have my Disneyland one. I don't need this one anymore, so I'm going to use this. Okay, the first thing you're going to do is take your card and shave the chalk into the water. And I'm only going to do two colors at a time because it needs to be pretty fast. I noticed that this chalk sinks after about 30 seconds, so I'll use purple and blue. Now I'll take my paper fold it a little bit, lower it all the way in, pull it up. You'll have to let the drips of water come off for a little bit. Okay. I see some purple, but mostly blue. I'm going to set this to the side on a paper towel because it's wet and I need it to dry. Then we'll make one more. See my chalk from before already floated down, so uh, now I can get new stuff. I'll use yellow and my green that I dipped in the water on accident. Okay, that's pretty good. Now I'll lower my paper and pull it back up. Let it drip a little. I didn't get some in the corner, but that's okay. I'm going to keep it that way. Set this to the side and let it dry. Okay, once your papers are all dry and they have chalk all over them, you might want to take some hairspray and actually spray the print so that the chalk doesn't smudge everywhere. It'll be very helpful if you're going to be handling these. For a little bit um yeah so that's that's it for printing oh well, chalk printing at least i hope you have fun and test this out and i can't wait to see what you come up with